My name is uh, Morten Elbæk. For the next coming three weeks, still the chief marketing officer of Vestas Wind Systems uh, until I started my new job as uh, the CEO of, um, of investment management firm. From a morality perspective that I've experienced in my career is the fact that people sitting in uh, leading positions, whether they're politicians or they are businessmen, that they uh, are so focused on their own uh, short-term uh, returns, meaning being so greedy when it comes to renewable energy instead of actually having the long light on. Uh, and we saw that uh, when we uh, were hit, most of us on this planet, by the financial crisis, how the backing to renewable energy suddenly, out of the blue, just disappeared. It didn't disappear among the consumers. The consumers continued to support it, but it was the corporate leaders and the politicians that turned their back to it. And just shows how, um, how fragile a foundation we stand on when, we, uh, when we're embarking on changing the engine mix of the world. We can see that uh, wind energy is going to go from being, together with solar, uh, going from being uh, called alternative to being mainstream. Uh, solar and wind is, uh, is speeding up uh, the cost of energy for gas, for oil, for nuclear around the world. Uh, and it's just a matter of time before uh, that there is no longer any whatsoever economical argument for not stopping the build-out of, um, of nuclear assets, of uh, exploration of oil and gas resources, and going for, for more renewable energy. And that will happen in my lifetime, and, and uh, if sensibility prevails, and if we have the courage as politicians, as business leaders, as citizens and human beings, to, uh, to continue the journey that we've just started out on. The risk is yet another financial crisis, and that financial crisis yet again will make us um, afraid uh, and greedy. Uh, and greed is the best friend of, of short-termness. Uh, and short-termness is the biggest enemy against any vision, because no vision that is great and beautiful and poetic is ever realized in just a moment. It's an absurd thought that you say, I'm just happy if what I do reduces negative impact to 30%. What type of vision is that for anybody that have ever carried a child in their arms? You need to be 100% positive for other human beings. And I think that if this conference continues to have that idealism or naivety, uh, then it will uh, create changes. But if not, it will be a conference like anyone else in, uh, in 10 years' time. And that disease, I hope C2 will... Uh, will always have a vaccine against.